Hey Exiles, how we doing? Alright, we are back playing some Saga of Survival. Alright, how we doing guys? So, different episode today. Um, I'm going to be doing a new recruitment for Dark Legion. So, this is something that I haven't been involved in for quite a little while now. So, and I think the biggest reason for me was I think I just sort of um, lost my commitment to the clan for a little while whilst playing other games and running the channel and doing everything else in between. And it's ultimately not the big, the best excuse I'm going to give um, for this one here. So unfortunately it is what it is. So what I'm going to be doing now is I'm going to reignite the, the clan. Um, basically I'm going to be turning it, um, turning over a lot of players that are not playing uh, the game or have not been participating for quite a, um, a long time. So for those that are still in my clan, they're going to remain. And I'm basically out on the hunt for new players. So with that being said, it's going to be a minimum requirement of level 30 for players to come through. I might even actually drop that down a little bit further. We'll see how we go, but minimum requirement of 30. The prerequisite to the clan that I want you guys to sort of look at is I want each and every one of you guys to have the ability to craft the circle of power. Okay. That's my minimum requirement from you guys there. Okay. So basically to obtain stone to make your stone blocks, uh, charcoal for wood and obviously iron ore, which can be obtained pretty much anywhere and the water barrel if you guys can so even if you guys haven't have or haven't had the ability to craft many water barrels there's only two that's required if you guys can upgrade your teal uh, fields to um, craft the water barrels or if you've got them um, in reserves then that'd be great if you guys can start using them basically what we're going to do is we're going to use th that workstation and we're just going to craft it, delete it, and craft it over again as much as we can to increase the XP. Basically, that's what I want to do. That's my intention for um, you know for this recruitment run. If you guys have the ability to do that, um, and just that alone, I'm not asking for anything else more than that. Um, for mainly for you know uh, for the XP challenge, then guys apply. So I'm going to start being a, a little bit more active on the um, on the um, on the clan channel. So you guys will, you know, obviously hear from me as well. I'll be maintaining it as best as I can, and obviously want to keep you guys as active as possible. And look, I get that a lot of people, you know, play the game for a little while, and they come and go. It is what it is. You know, it always happens with any sort of other game that anyone plays, essentially. So. There's really not much else that we can do with that. And I think I've sort of glitched out there. So I'm just going to run quickly out of the zone. We'll run back in. But yeah, so at the moment, I'm sitting on about 25, 26 players right now. But they're all not active. Right now, I've only got about seven to eight of us active at the moment. So if you, if you do the math there, I'm going to be looking at at least uh, 20 players to come in. So that's a lot of people that I want to get in. Um, so basically, as I said, I'm outlaying this here in the video. All I want from you guys to do is if you guys can uh, craft the circle of power um, and have the resources to back you, that's all I want um, from each person. It all depends on your player level and what is available to you. So if you guys have all of that in abundance, then craft as many as you guys can. If you guys can only craft, say, I don't know, two to three different sets, then that's fine. Because that's going to get you close to about 15,000 points right there. If you do at least three shots at that circle of power. And if we add that up against, um, you know, 20 or more, uh, 30 or more players, then we're going to have a decent amount of XP to play with. And for those higher ranked players that can do, you know, maybe 10, maybe to 20, let's say. Um, that's going to obviously elevate us into uh, second tier armor right off the bat, possibly even close to third. 
Um, if not, maybe we'll be on well our way, well on the way to get to legendary status on each of those. And ultimately, that's what I want for you guys. So you guys have the ability to, um, you know, get the um, higher tier armor for yourselves. So at least this way, um, you guys don't have to spend resources on crafting poor armor and things like that you guys can use that for you know quite a number of um you know quite a while and before it has to be that you need to swap it out and get something else or you know uh keep them for you know as like a bit of a show a trophy or a showpiece i guess but that's basically where it's at um i hope you guys you know consider joining um like i said i'm going to try and stay active as best as i can i'll check in at least maybe once a day um, probably my day, middle of the day, so I'm not too sure how that looks for everyone else. Um, I might be just doing that. So at the moment, I'm glitched. I can't actually open up the chest, unfortunately. So I'm going to have to back out of the game and get back into it so I can open up the chest. But that's okay. Um, this is not what what the video is about today, opening up or looting or anything like that. But um, I think that's basically where I'm going to leave it for. And I really, really hope you guys are um, interested in joining um unfortunately like i said i really dropped the ball um and not you know maintained uh, my clan but so basically what i'm saying is i'm going to try and make a better commitment to you know um have the clan as active as possible and i hope you guys in um appreciate that that's basically what i'm looking for but as i said if you guys can do that alone then like i said i don't see why you guys shouldn't be joining up um, if you guys are looking for a new clan, let's build it. And what I'm wanting to do as well is I want to go beyond 30 players. We'll go up to 50, whatever it takes. And hopefully that makes um, everyone else's lives a little bit easier um, in order for us to you know, get better loot at the end of the day. And especially not just the XP challenge itself, but all the other challenges that are involved. Um, I'll try my best to stay active with all of them as well. Like I said, there's only so much that, you know, one person can do with that. So, um, but like I said, I will try my best. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this very, very short video for today. Um, I'm going to leave it here. I just wanted to bring this video up so at least you guys can um, have a look at it, have some time to think about it. Um, we're not going to go hard throughout the week. I'm going to be posting this up on Monday. Um, so hopefully it gives you uh, up until Friday to make a decision if you want to go if you guys want to jump over or if you guys want to join up definitely go ahead and do that and we'll start from the XP challenge moving forward. All right guys um, take it easy. Thanks for watching thanks for tuning in. Um, be sure to hit the like button uh, really help me out with this video in particular. Uh, comment down below if you guys are interested in joining things like that just go ahead and do it. It's Dark Legion capital D. Uh, for Dark, Space, capital L for Legion. That's it. That's all you need to do. Type that into, into the clan system and just go ahead and join up, guys. All right. So for now, minimum level 30. And all I want you guys to do for now with the XP challenge is to do the Circle of Power. And if you guys have any other preferred workstations, then you guys go ahead and do that and just um and cycle through that whatever make, makes your lives easier but i feel that if we do this consistently i think we'll have a very good chance on getting decent loot anyway that's it for me thanks for watching i'll catch you next time